What is up everyone? Welcome back to another video. Shinman Takazo here and today we got a new hero in the advanced server again. So let's check him out. There we go. We got this hero named Claude. Yeah, he uh... Yeah. He's a guy. So let's see what he looks like. <laughs> Hey, get out! I already gave you your share, little guy. Alright everyone, welcome the new hero, Star-Lord. I mean, uh, Claude. And what the heck is Sun doing here? Okay, he looks pretty good. He looks like Clint from the future. So let's check out his skills in-game and let's see what he's all about. Alright guys, so we are in-game and he's looking really good with that with that uh, fuckboy haircut and you see here a monkey is uh, yeah is on his shoulders <laughs> it looks really nice alright so let's talk about his skills so first the passive so Dexter the monkey launches an attack to help Claude and deals 20% of Claude's damage in bonus damage to enemy units that were damaged by Claude's basic attacks so basically if you attack someone with a basic attack your monkey the monkey on your shoulder will fire an attack as well there we go, two damages. So that's 20%. And if you increase your attack, like if you build attack items, that damage from the monkey should increase as well because it says here that uh, Dexter also enjoys basic attack bonus. So yeah, just 20% of your attack power, of your damage. So pretty useful, probably if it will work with Demon Hunter Sword, you can trigger passives fast, just like Aerithil right now. Okay, so why don't we try that out? I'm gonna get Demon Hunter Sword and see, see if the passive triggers separately on Claude's basic attacks and Dexter's basic attack. Instead of two damages, we should be getting four if that works. There we go, yeah, definitely works. So Demon Hunter Sword might be a really good item because of the passive. So he attacks twice, triggers item passives twice. Now let's talk about his skill 1. So it says that Claude steals 30% movement speed and 14% attack speed of enemies in a fan shaped area. Deals uh, physical damage and Claude increases his own movement speed and attack speed for 6 seconds. Alright so he steals attack speed and movement speed. The speed bonus of Claude is doubled when stealing speed from enemy heroes. So it's simply a buff, right? You get attack speed, you get movement speed for 6 seconds and it also damages them, but not, not that much. But if you steal from enemy heroes like Zilong here, then... Yeah, don't kill me Zilong, I'm trying to make a video here. Then yeah, you get more, more movement speed and more attack speed. Oh, there we go. Now we're talking. works on anything any enemies you steal attack speed and movement speed from multiple heroes or multiple targets in a fan shaped area very nice buff helps you with escaping now what about his second skill battle mirror image so you put dexter the monkey in a designated location or a mirror image there we go and it will last 5 seconds and deal 100% of Dexter's physical damage. So that's 20% damage of uh, Claude's damage. And then Claude can activate this skill again to switch places with the mirror image. Oh, okay, that's interesting. Let's try it out here. Where, where Zilong cannot disturb us. Alright, so I put it down. It lasts for 5 seconds. And then I press it, press it again. I switch place with the mirror image. Okay, so you can use this for escape. And it also deals damage to anything around it. There we go. And the Demon Hunter Sword works on it. Since it's still the monkey firing shots. So it's ca uh, counted as basic attacks. There you go. Two damage, right? Demon Hunter Sword. So it's just uh, putting down your monkey for a while. Because he's uh, getting too heavy. But yeah, switching places. For example, you're escaping like this. You can uh, put it to your back or behind you and then press it you swap places with that mirror image and you can go back as long as the five seconds has not run out very nice skill I have not seen any skill like this there we go you can go far away and then boom you can um, oh wait it's it's hardly skill 
<laughs> Just like Harley Skill. Alright, now let's talk about his ultimate. His ultimate is this big area around him. He uh, he attacks with a lot of basic attacks damaging everyone around him. Let me just show you for a bit. There we go. And you see those crits. It is because all the shots coming out in that area uh, is considered basic attacks. So it can trigger uh, Demon, Demon Hunter Sword, Critical Strikes, Life Steal. So uh, I may need to like make a separate video for that, but yeah, every single attack from that is considered a basic attack. So this ultimate also gives you shield for a few seconds while you're doing the ultimate, that dancing around thing. And it also said that if you get a lot of attack speed on Claude, this ultimate will increase in firing rate. So more shots will be shot, I guess. So yeah, what do I think about this guy? I think he's pretty powerful right now. Every item works on his skills because his skills are considered basic attacks as well. Especially his ultimate, man. Like, how many shots are in this ultimate? And if all those shots like trigger item passives like Demon Hunter Sword and crits and lifesteal, that's gonna be really OP. But of course, this is still in the advanced server. He just came out. They're definitely gonna make adjustments. So I'll be reviewing this guy right before he comes out in the original server like an in-depth review. So make sure uh, to check that out in the future. And uh, yeah, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think about this uh, hero, Claude. Do you think he's good? Do you like him? Do you think he needs a nerf? Do you think he should get a raccoon pet instead of a monkey? So again guys, thank you so much for watching. My name is Shinman Takizo and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Star-Lord. Who? Star-Lord, man.